Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Dak Deck, and for today's daily climb, we are the Watcher. Oh god, we start off with Chimera. We've also got red cards. There's a little bit of terminal. I might be uploading videos as we do this, so we've got a load of Pokemon on there instead. It's fine. We don't really need the leaderboard yet anyway, only to see where Burst was, but I'm sure we can find that one out at the end. Three elites up the left. No rests whatsoever. That seems concerning. I think I'm going to go for two elites up the middle. Maybe we'll veer left here and go to the shop. Maybe we'll veer right and not go to the shop. How's that sound? Rather than going for all elites for a change. Odds on me killing you next turn don't look great, do they? Actually, they look somewhat decent with the miracle as well. Plus the vulnerability and both strikes. Actually, we only needed one strike. Well, that's even better then. You know what? I am going to take a halt. Being as though we've only got Eruption, maybe we go for a full Wrath build. Not that I've ever done that one before, but... 22 health. We could do 21 damage. I wouldn't be able to kill both of you this turn. I mean, I can't really block it all anyway. Mm, why can I not work 15 out? Anybody? I think we're just going to go like that. And then hit you this turn. It'll be fine. We're taking one damage. Oh no, right. Um, attacks. <laughs> Please, give me some attacks. Whoa, steady on there. We want to erupt just to make sure I can do the, uh, the required damage. You know what? I'm going to take a pummel. It's a little bit weird. Do we want to take regret? That would mean we've kind of got to go to the shop. I'll take regret. Ooh. Worthy trade. Ooh, wasn't worth that. God damn it, strawberry. What are you doing to me? Um, get rid of the regret. And I can kill you, and then we take no damage. Happy days. I am forgetting about my plated armor. Yes. Not that it really mattered, but I need to try and remember. We've got plated armor. Don't need to play all blocks. A smoke bomb. Hmm. I want to take the third eye. I was a little interested in the anger. Only a little bit. Do I dare wake you up this turn? I actually think this is going to be a bad fight. A real bad fight. I'm going to go turn one. We're going to see what's happening next turn, and I may just smoke bomb away from this. Because we've got 16 damage there. That takes us to 28. We can't really block that much. 14. No, I'm going to smoke bomb out of that. We've not got the cards for it. I know it seems a little bit pathetic, but we're on a six win streak. Ooh, you know what? I will pay you seven health to remove regret. It's not cost me seven health yet, but normally it would have done by this point. And we're going to smith. Smith on eruption first. Not sure if that's the best choice, but fair enough. We do want to go for a bit of a scrying deck then to make that work somewhat. Why do you keep giving me eruption turn one game? Is there something wrong? Um, next turn then, what would we like? Can I block you this turn? If I go eruption, survive, defend, I could actually do it. So next turn, we'd really like to kill one of you. Drop the zap. I think that's all I'm going to drop. And then we can block everything this turn. We've got Hulk coming next turn. I really need to get you killed. There's the Hulk. 17. If I want to keep the perfect, I've got to defend here. Now it's going to get a little bit iffy. The Hulk is good. You're also rather good. Well, it's more damage. Let's try and take this dude out next turn. We'd need three strikes mixed in with the dazers. 
18 block. Should have gone for this guy. Oh, it's 16. Oh, no. We're going to take damage, so I might as well. We're not going to need defense next turn, so I'm just going to flatten you. It's a shame that we lost the perfect, but we've not taken much damage. Which is a good thing, obviously. Oh, too many dazers. At least let me get a good block in this turn. That is what I would call a good block. Don't want the daze, don't want the daze, don't want defend, defend, halt. Don't really want the zap. It is 9-8 damage. I'll leave the zap in there. So it's just that one turn where we took 4 damage. It is quite the shame. Got you. It was a bit of a strategical fight. The boot's kind of worthless to us. I am going to take an empty fist. Being able to get back out of stances is quite nice. 174 gold. I'm going to go left. Or leave. We got the gold before a shop. I'll just take that. Thank you. With the drop kick, we have got vulnerability. Well... We could get even more scrying. I'm going to take these two. You know what? I'm going to take indignation as well. With the drop kick, vulnerability is kind of at a premium. I'll heal for that little bit of gold. Oh, we've got hexaghost. No point looking there. I didn't want to upgrade. That was a rookie mistake. And we're going to snuff it. <laughs> no, we're not. Although hexaghost's first turn, we can't be in eruption stance. Luckily, we can get back out of it. Maybe? That's a lot of damage, dude. And we know we've got no way out of stands coming, so I'm not even going to entertain it. We'll need a block for next turn. I'll save the hole and get rid of everything else like that. Survivor away indignation? You're doing 30 damage. We've managed to block it. That is mostly impressive. Mostly impressive, not most impressive. It's mostly impressive. And with that vulnerability, we can actually pan your face in. Here comes a lot of damage then. We can get to 18 block. I'm just going to start hitting you. Shame we've lost the perfect. It'll be fine though. We've not... Yeah, we have had drop kick so far. 12 damage. Let's go bash third eye. You're not going to attack next turn. I don't want that. Don't want that. Don't really want the zap either. I will take the indignation still. Just so I can get more vulnerability on you. Hmm. Does the plated armor play before the burn again? It does play before. Uh, go with the drop kick. Shame we're not in wrath form anymore. That halt would have been nice. That halt, that defense from halt. Yep, I was almost right. Um, I'll keep the survivor. We're not taking damage. Get the zap out there. We're going to get the kill. It's just a shame it's not the perfect kill. Would have been much nicer. Twelve plus thirteen plus lightning on top of that. We'd got you. Absolutely got you. Corruption's very risky. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Corruption is brilliant. Sneko is not so brilliant. <laughs> I took corruption because once we've exhausted all the skills, we're left with one, two, three, four, five. Six, that doesn't technically count. Seven, we can go endless. I am actually going to take Sneko. Now, that's a little bit insane. But with the corruption, we can hopefully get that cheaper than normal. And then burn all the skills away. Three elites up the left, plus a not instant early shop. I think we can go quite well with this. I mean, look at that right there. Go with the eruption, go with the bash, go with the drop kick, which didn't actually work out. 
We're fine. We'll leave it there. I'm not going to third eye and try and scry. 16 plus 18. It wouldn't get the kill, but it's a lot of damage. And then just a basic defend to block. We've always got the two energy crescendo. If we need to go a little bit more, you'd go up to 12. You know what? Play the corruption. Play the crescendo. Indignation doesn't do anything, really. I don't know why I'm messing around. I just needed to play the potion. It's a good job I didn't waste any more energy. Mm -mm, mm -mm -mm. I think we want to be real careful about what we add now. Yes, actually. Remove strikes. We don't need them. And we can burn the rest away. Remove strikes. You know what? Because we've got a shop coming right there, we should have enough gold to remove pain. So I'm going to take it. Corruption got upgraded. Well, that's a shame because it already cost two. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Don't want the pain. That is lovely. Everything else? Yes, please, because I want to be burning it all away. Excuse me. So it wasn't that long ago that we actually already had a perfect run. Apparently we're going to have another one. That is just ridiculous amounts of damage. Don't know why I played everything else then. Survivor away pain. Go with the bash, go with the drop kick. Pain would have been coming back there. I can guarantee Oh my god, another drop kick. Seems like we've found the right path to go down. Don't attack. He's not attacking. We have got to hit, take pain to the face, unfortunately. Hopefully I can at least get one of these dudes dead. Yeah, absolutely. I'd like to try and get two of them dead. Definitely want the corruption. Drop the str... Leave it. Leave the strike. We're not taking damage. Hopefully you're going to go for a summon and not go for an attack. Yours. Yes, please. Mm, would I be able to kill you with a bash? I would. So we're going to have to go like that. You are going to get a double summon. This is where we need a little bit of AoE. Definitely indignation right now. 24 damage kills you. Can't play the strike. That was a little bit of an oversight. Drop the pain. We'll keep the rest of it coming. Yeah, that pain definitely needs removing. You're not attacking. You're not attacking. Wonderful. I knew pain was going to come out early there. It's fine that you're going to go for a summon. Pain's going to sting a lot here. Really is. We didn't get a single drop kick. That's bad. I'll start by surviving away pain. What are you guys doing? 16 damage? I can play a defend and get there. Because I'm just going to start laying waste to you. We've got the drop kicks coming next turn. Both of them. Hopefully they're not both going to cost ridiculous amounts of energy. Play this. Play this. Go with the drop kick. Go with the drop kick. We've got you. Perfect. Beautiful. That pain needs removing though. The gold's not building up as much as I wanted. You know what? I'll take a clothesline, being as though we've got snack eye. No point upgrading corruption. Might as well upgrade the drop kick. But with the uh, the prongs, it doesn't really matter. I'm not even looking at anything else. Pain needs to go. Can we afford? No, not a single thing. Fair enough, game. Fair enough. Bloop. Mm. <laughs> God damn it. 
Um, let's get an upgrade on the bash, just for the vulnerability's sake. And then we'll go for a question mark. Indignation would be quite nice here. Speaking of indignation, uh, we might as well go eruption first. Indignation into the drop kick. Oh, corruption. Play the zap. Play the third eye. We'll see what's coming next. I'll keep basically everything coming. I could empty fist. Mm. No, I couldn't empty fist. What a waste of a uh, miracle there. Why did I think I had one energy left? Nobody knows. Well, that kills you and gives me a single energy back. We've already got the block. Let's start on you next. No point burning away them yet. <clears throat> Huntley was fantastic there, by the way. Hopefully I can get a kill very quickly here. I can. You are doing 18 damage. Maybe it's worth empty fisting out. Yeah. It was definitely worth empty fisting out. Lightning's got you. Oh, close. Oh, close. Fear potion is rather nice. Uh, no. Don't want any of those. Single target elites are the best thing for us. I'm actually just going to throw this at you straight away. I know it means you're doing a ridiculous amount of damage. How about we try and limit that? 18. Oh, beautiful. Burn this away, yes please. No point playing anything else. We need to hit you hard and we need to hit you fast. The Holt's good. Defend. We've already got enough block. Probably shouldn't have gone much more on that. You know, I will empty fist stacks. We can crescendo back in next turn. It'd be nice if the drop kicks kept um, uh, stopped screwing me over. Go with the indignation, burn that way. Third eye. It does give us drop kick next. Well, we know we've got drop kick coming next turn. I'm kind of hoping. We've got enough punch to get the kill there, though. Yes, we do. Singing bowl, very nice. I don't want another indignation. We get enough vulnerability from the one that we've got. We're probably going to do the fight here. Oh, that's a painful start, isn't it? I think corruption's still up the way forward here. Can I get a clothesline out there? I mean, we're going for the kill on you first anyway, and you're doing the most damage. It doesn't really matter what we drop, because we can't play anything else. We're taking the smallest amount of damage. Well, not quite the smallest, but very nearly. Very nearly. We can play everything else for free anyway, so there's no point crescendoing. Then we can go like that. Play the hole. You're not doing any damage. Burn that away. You know what? I'm going to try a different tactic. We're just going to burn everything away as quick as possible. To get down to that endlessness. Oh, we can't attack this turn. I was meant to kill you last turn. <laughs> well played, game. Well played. That's a painful turn. Now you're going to feel it. Maybe not, actually. The drop kicks need to be one or less. <sighs> Luckily, the clothesline's got you. I'm still going to fight. I'm still going to fight. Straight away, we're going on this dude. Because we want you dead as quickly as possible. Can't really afford to go indignation this turn. I am just going to keep punching you. Because your damage really doesn't make any difference to me. Oh no, you are going to get stronger. Bye. Same trick again, actually. We're just going to burn through everything. Does give us the potential to get hit in the face. But. I think we've got this. Not got this. That does mean we take no damage. We'll slow play this turn then. Still don't know if this counts. Counts as a um, elite fight or not. 
Uh, let's go crescendo first indignation. Play the hold, play the defend. We've got the most expensive drop kicks known to man. But luckily we only need one. Captain's Wheel and Eternal Feather are both very nice choices there. Perfected Strike can't really work well. Because we've got one strike. It's a shame. Give me the max HP. At least we're countering the um, terminal. And yet again, AoE. AoE is bad. Okay. The amount of damage these guys are going to do is also going to be rather bad. But I'm burning everything away. Oh! Wow. <laughs> Maybe I should have done a little bit of maths there. Well, that's an upset. That was going to be seven wins in a row. God damn it. God damn it. And I didn't even notice in time to do a reset because I'd messed the maths up. I didn't do any maths. I just thought I'd live. Burst all the way up there on front page again. God damn it. Where did we come? We will never speak of this daily ever again after today. 477th with a load of Pokemon around me. 11 hours and 15 minutes remaining. I'm fairly sure we're not going to make the top 1,000 with that score. My bad. <laughs> My bad. Anyway, um, slightly better daily yesterday. It is only slightly, though. We were the Ironclad. We came in 224th with 13 hours remaining. It was fun. It was a whirlwind daily. We always like those. I know, unknowns everywhere. It doesn't really matter. 364th, we lost, like, what? 140 places exactly in 13 hours. It could have been better. But it couldn't have been worse than today's daily. God damn it. Well, apologies for that um, catastrophic upset. But uh, that's going to be it for today's episode. So thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more. All comments, feedback, greatly appreciated as always. And other than that, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.